Hey everybody, this is Ryan Hickey. Are the Steelers the best team in the NFL? Can they beat the Chiefs in the postseason? I'd love to hear your thoughts. Comment below if the Steelers are the best team in the NFL if you think they can beat the Chiefs in the playoffs. For me, coming off of that Wednesday afternoon game, and how 2020 is it that the NFL has a Wednesday afternoon game, by the way? In a wacky year, why not have a wacky NFL schedule? But coming off that Wednesday afternoon game, which the Steelers defeat the Ravens 19-14, going to 11-0 in the season, my biggest takeaway from that game is that I don't think the Steelers have what it takes to beat the Chiefs, dethrone Kansas City, and go to the Super Bowl to represent the AFC. For me, my concern comes from more the offensive side than the defensive side. But I do want to hit on defense first. Because to me, I'm a little concerned that Pittsburgh has built their team based on great defense. Because in the year 2020, when the rules are geared towards helping offense to score points, when better athletes are moving to the offensive side of the football, it's hard for great defenses to slow down great offenses. The old saying in the NFL, defenses win championships. Well, in today's NFL, great offenses beat great defenses. No better example of this than let's just go back to last year's Super Bowl, 49ers versus the Chiefs. Great defense by San Francisco. For three and a half quarters, they slowed down Patrick Mahomes, they slowed down Andy Reid, and they slowed down this potent, high-octane Chiefs offense. But what happened? You can slow down the Chiefs for a quarter, for a half, for three quarters. In the end, great offenses always prevail, and as we know, you can't keep Patrick Mahomes and this Chiefs offense down for a full game. Chiefs come back, score touchdowns, they're the ones hoisting the Lombardi Trophy, not the 49ers. So that's Super Bowl proof. You can keep this Chiefs offense down for a little, but in the end, you can't keep them down. You can't slow them down for a full four quarters. So what does that mean? You need to have an offense that can put the Chiefs away. You need an offense that can score points, put the game out of reach, and capitalize when your defense is slowing down this Chiefs offense. And I'll be honest, I don't think Pittsburgh has the offense to do so. Now, I will say this. In terms of points per game, they're sixth in the NFL. The Steelers do score a lot of points. When you dive beyond the box score, when you dive just beyond the points per game, there's not much that the Steelers offense does well. They are 22nd in the NFL in yards per game, 25th in rushing offense, 16th in passing offense. So they don't really do a lot offensively that kind of scares you. There's no real strength of that team that you feel intimidated by if you're an opposing offense. Now, especially with struggling in the run game, they've tried to supplement that by throwing short underneath passes. The issue for Pittsburgh is they have the sixth most drops in the NFL. And you know what those drops represent? Extra opportunities for the Chiefs offense to get back on the field. Those drops, especially if they're on third down, put your defense on the field longer, give Patrick Holmes more opportunities to score, more opportunities to have success, not what you want for Pittsburgh. So I look at this Pittsburgh offense, not only do they struggle moving the ball, struggle running the ball, really struggle to do anything well, they also don't have the offense to put teams away, the exact thing you need to have if you want to beat the Chiefs. Plenty of examples so far this year of games where the Pittsburgh offense has failed to put games away and instead relied on their defense to bail them out in the end. Games against, let's say, the Broncos, the Texans, the Titans. Both times they played the Ravens this year, they've had to have their defense bail them out late. And the Cowboys. All games in which the offense kind of sputtered along, maybe had a good half or so, but didn't make the plays in the end to put those games away. If you don't put the Chiefs away, if you are sputtering or only have one good half of offensive football, I'm sorry, you're not beating the Chiefs. So I don't see much from Pittsburgh's offense that gives me confidence that they can go either into Kansas City or host the Chiefs and beat them in the postseason. So for me, defense is great for Pittsburgh. Absolutely. They will slow down the Chiefs and Patrick Holmes for sure. But you're going to need your offense to put the game away. I don't think the Steelers have the offense to do so. So for me, my big takeaway coming out of that Wednesday afternoon game, I don't think the Steelers have what it takes to beat the Chiefs in the playoffs. But again, I'd love to hear your thoughts. Comment below. Are the Steelers the best team in the NFL? Can they beat the Chiefs in the postseason?